it is possible to write as many service level rules as you wish against your group of assets or against your business service. In this example, I have already set up a low priority rule and a medium priority rule. I will now write a high priority rule. You choose the criteria which includes any property that exists within the incident form. So in this example, we will say the priority is less than or equal to three, i.e. the priority within the incident ticket. Uh, we could also choose uh, any other data variable or property within the incident form, such as support group, uh, impact, uh, etc. There are many properties that exist. For the rule, we shall choose a calendar which was set up previously. We shall choose the 24 by 7 by 365 calendar because this is a high priority uh, incident. We shall say the operational level agreement time to respond is 10 minutes. The service level is 15. The operational time to fix is 45. And we shall say the service level is 90. By checking these boxes, this will automatically notify the escalation team should the operational level agreement not be achieved for time to respond or should the service level time to fix not be achieved. We have now added a high priority uh, service level rule to this uh, service level. It's as easy as that. If you have liked what you have seen in this demo, please make contact with Case Dimensions so we can help you. Uh, we can run proof of concepts on site with clients. This is a chargeable service. Uh, if you would like a demonstration, we can do live meetings and show you the technology in life. Uh, we also have an online lab where you can log into over the internet and play with the interface yourself. So please contact us on the email uh, shown or go to, to our website for further information. Thanks. Bye.